రామాయ రామభద్రాయ రామచంద్రాయ వేదసే రఘునాథాయ నాథాయ సీతాయాపతయ నమ డిస్టింగ్విష్డ్ స్కాలర్స్ హూ ఆర్ ఆన్ ద డ్యాస్ అమాంగ్ దెమ్ ప్రొఫెసర్ శ్రీనివాస్ వార్ఖేడి మై ఫ్రెండ్ నవ్ వైస్ ఛాన్సలర్ ఆఫ్ సాంస్క్రిట్ యూనివర్సిటీ అండ్ ప్రొఫెసర్ గౌర్ అండ్ ఆల్సో ప్రొఫెసర్ సంపరానంద మిశ్ర ఐ మై సెల్ఫ్ డిడ్ ఏ నేషనల్ కాన్ఫరెన్స్ అండ్ రామాయణ టూ థౌజండ్ ఎయిటీన్ ఇన్ జేఎన్యూ అండ్ దెర్ వాజ్ సో మచ్ డిస్కషన్ ఇట్ వాజ్ వండర్ఫుల్ కాన్ఫరెన్స్ అండ్ దెన్ ఐ ఆమ్ ఆల్సో ఎంగేజ్ ఇన్ రామాయణ కంబోడియా రామాయణ బికాస్ ఐ వాజ్ ఇన్ కంబోడియా అండ్ దెన్ వెన్ ఐ సా దిస్ బుక్ ఈస్ ఎ వండర్ఫుల్ వర్క్ బికాస్ వాట్ ఐ అండర్స్టాండ్ ఏఏ మానవలన్ హ్యాస్ రిటర్న్ దిస్ తమిళ్ లాంగ్వేజ్ అండ్ సిటీ ఇంద్రా అండ్ ప్రేమా జగన్నాథన్ హ్యావ్ ట్రాన్స్లేటెడ్ ఇన్ టు ఇంగ్లీష్ ఫ్రమ్ తమిళ్ అండ్ దిస్ ఈజ్ ఆల్ టుగెదర్ యూ కెన్ అండర్స్టాండ్ దట్ దిస్ ఈస్ ఎ కాంట్రిబ్యూషన్ ఆఫ్ రామాయణ ఫ్రమ్ తమిళనాడు ఫ్రమ్ తమిళ్ స్కాలర్స్ అండ్ ఇట్స్ క్వైట్ న్యాచురల్ బికాస్ Ramayana is famous, I can say more famous in southern parts of India. Every street we have Rama temple. In every street there must be Rama temple. It's a kind of situation there. So Rama is very famous in, in every, every part of India, particularly southern part. So naturally there was a... a discussion and uh, concentration and ramayana and a uh, manavalan he did a wonderful job really what he did is a is a is a great job he collected so many ramayana works and wrote in tamil language and uh, in his book uh, in his foreword and uh, in other um, uh, in the in the introduction of his book and also inside the book very interesting things are there jate jagati valmikau kavirityam bhida bhavat kavi iti tato vyase kavayastvai dandini so when valmiki was born in in the world the word kavi also was born because there was no poet before valmiki so there was no word also because every word needs meaning no so when there was no kavi there was no word poet also the word poet came only after balmiki was born in the world because he was the first poet we needed the word kavi so then balmiki was a first poet and he was living when rama was living that is what we know so balmiki was contemporary to rama this is a also a kind of a famous uh, perception the concept also we have we believe also like that but what is written uh, here very scholarly it's a kind of uh, thorough research what is mentioned in the, in the book is actually valmiki ramayana was very famous in india the, the ramayana story was existing before valmiki it was famous in the form of folk tales in the form of songs in the form of uh, uh, regional languages and uh, like in oral tradition it was living ramakatha and from there valmiki has collected all those traditions oral traditions then he composed it in a nice poem it's a ramayana and also some other scholars believe that it was first composed in by buddhists that is also written by the scholar in the foreword indra parthasarathi writes because uh, first ramayana is dasharatha dasharatha jataka and uh, it was um, uh because uh, dashrath jataka's time is uh, bc 5th century the rama comes out and he goes to himalayas there not to the forest he goes to himalayas and there is no war in that ramayana buddhist buddhist ramayana waha yudh nahi hai because buddhists are non violent and they are peace loving and uh, from there uh, he has taken uh, valmiki also has gathered even buddhist version also that's what is written here so in this way when you take ramayana there are so many uh, um, uh, interesting things 
and uh, later on ramayana developed such an extent i can say field of sanskrit we are working for a long time there is no such a single poem in sanskrit literature which is like ramayana there are several poems but no poem could become like a ramayana like ramayana is ramayana became such a famous it's very wonderful sometimes we uh, think why it became such a famous so it crossed the boundaries and it entered into many countries and all regions in india and many countries also it went to southeast asia and also other parts of the world only rama story we have kalidasa's poems also we have many great poems but only ramayana could have that privilege and therefore it went to southeast asia cambodians wrote uh, reem k they say reem k their version and uh, in thai thailand it they also wrote they say ramakian they say in laos also pre lake pre reem they lake lake means lakshmana if you go there you find lake 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 like that many names you cannot all sanskrit names and all sanskrit words but you cannot understand what they are pronouncing so this is the influence of ramayana so before buddhists buddhist influence on south asia ramayana has influenced everywhere and in south east asia they had their own ramayanas but later part but in the first first 6th uh, century to 14th century they used it to study only valmiki ramayana and that is evident from the temples the sculptures if you see you see several temples bafun temple and other temples angkor wat also the sculptures of ramayana are not in reem k so they are from valmiki ram because reem k is different version they have changed little bit according to because this it happened to ramayana it is mentioned in this book also writer mary clearly mentioned how these changes he came because according to the various situations according to climatical situation according to the regional influences so indigenous uh, indigenous qualities have entered into ramayana and they indigenize ramayana everybody wants to write according to their own region according to their own language according to their own customs traditions so so ramayana you cannot see ramayana is such a famous poem that is why uh, and this book uh, uh, particularly its uh, tamil name is uh, rama kathayum ramayanangalum that is the original name of this book rama kathayum ramayanangalum so it takes uh, three kandas basically uh, bala kanda ayodhya kanda and aranya kanda and uh, important events of these three kandas are thoroughly discussed comparative study comparative literature it is it is mentioned here comparative study comparative study of rama kathas it is very difficult work and uh, one of the uh, writers mentioned that comparative study is a, is a new a, a kind of field of uh, literature it started in modern uh, uh, times but comparative literature comparative study was there in ancient times also so i don't agree with that because comparative study was there in sanskrit literature also because when you see the commentaries and bhashyas there was a comparative study already anye apare kechit this is all comparative study only sanketita chatur bheda jatyadir jatireva so some some people say like that some people say like this. this is a kind of comparative study was there in our ancient shastras already so in this way how many ramayanas they have collected list also is is given in the table 48 ramayanas you see jasa jatakam anamakam jatakam also is there one buddhist anamakam jatakam then valmiki ramayana bala bharatam also is there dasharatha kathanam is there raghuvamsha also and the paumacharya from jains also they wrote paumacharya it is very famous and uh, vasudeva hindi also is there that is also jain version of uh, jain versions two are there and uh, narasimha purana and uh, in this way it's very famous uh, ramayana and they have taken all these versions and uh, compared that great uh, the writer uh, manavalan uh, comparing uh, taking these all versions and comparing in the important events is very interesting it is inspiring everybody not only important indian languages ramayana texts from sanskrit sanskrit not only these texts also they have taken in the list you can see later on they have taken the text from southeast asia also that also has been taken and compared so folk tales in tamil 
ఫోక్ టైల్స్ మన తెలుగు ఆల్సో ఇన్ తెలుగు వీ హ్యావ్ మొల్ల రామాయణం అండ్ మొల్ల రామాయణ ఈజ్ ది తెలుగు వర్షన్ ఆఫ్ రామాయణ బట్ లేటర్ ఆన్ ఏ గ్రేట్ పోయెట్ నేమ్డ్ విశ్వనాథ సత్యనారాయణ రోట్ రామాయణ కల్పవృక్షం ఇన్ తెలుగు ఇట్స్ బికేమ్ వెరీ ఫేమస్ సో విశ్వనాథ సత్యనారాయణ హూ గాట్ జ్ఞానపీఠ అవార్డ్ ఫస్ట్ టైం ఇన్ ద తెలుగు లిటరేచర్ హీ హీ రోట్ దిస్ రామాయణ కల్పవృక్షం సో అండ్ దెన్ ఇన్ సాంస్క్రిట్ ట్రెడిషన్ ఆల్సో వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ దెర్ ఆర్ సో మెనీ వర్షన్స్ దట్ ఈస్ వై సాంస్క్రిట్ పీపుల్ సమ్ ఇయర్స్ ఎగో ఇండియాస్ ఫోర్ మోస్ట్ ఎపిక్ రామాయణ దట్ ఈస్ వై ఇట్ వా దే హ్యాడ్ మెనీ ప్రివిలెంట్ వర్షన్స్ ఆర్ ది దట్ ఈస్ వై ద ఓరియంటల్ ఇన్స్ట్ ఆఫ్ బరోడా ఇంపెల్డ్ బై ద ఎఫర్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ మెనీ స్కాలర్స్ హూ ఫెల్ట్ దట్ ఎ క్రిటికల్ ఎడిషన్ మస్ట్ బి ప్రిపేర్డ్ ఫర్ ఇట్ అండ్ టుక్ అప్ దిస్ టాస్క్ వాజ్ గివెన్ బై జి హెచ్ భట్ ఎట్ ద టైమ్ అండ్ ఇట్ వాజ్ ఫస్ట్ ఎడిటెడ్ అండ్ పబ్లిష్ ఇన్ నైన్టీన్ ఫిఫ్టీ వన్ అండ్ ఇట్ అప్రోచ్ ద వేరియస్ లైబ్రరీస్ అండ్ ఇన్ ద కంట్రీస్ ఇట్ కలెక్టెడ్ మెనీ రామాయణాస్ అండ్ ఇట్ అండ్ దే గాట్ టూ థౌజండ్ ఫైవ్ హండ్రెడ్ వర్షన్స్ ఆఫ్ రామాయణ దే హ్యావ్ కలెక్టెడ్ ఫర్ ది బడోదా వర్షన్ అండ్ బట్ దే హ్యావ్ సెలెక్టెడ్ ఓన్లీ ఎయిటీ సిక్స్ స్క్రిప్ట్స్ అవుట్ ఆఫ్ దెమ్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ది ఎయిటీ సిక్స్ స్క్రిప్ట్స్ దే హ్యావ్ మేడ్ ది క్రిటికల్ ఎడిషన్ ఆఫ్ బడోదా ఈజ్ వెరీ ఫేమస్ అండ్ వన్ స్కాలర్ కేమ్ ఫ్రమ్ గుజరాత్ హీ వాస్ టెలింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ సేమ్ ప్లేస్ వెరీ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ థింగ్స్ బికాస్ బడోదా వర్షన్ ఇన్ సదరన్ వర్షన్ that uh, they did not accept many verses which are very popular like uh, lakshmana saying naham janami ke yure naham janami kundale nupure tvabhi janami nityam padabhi vandanat so this is a famous this shows the lakshmana's greatness but uh, they did not accept this because lakshmana cannot say like this and also it is not it is impractical lakshman ne bolta hai ki ఆభూషణ్ మిలితే సీతాకే ఓ లక్షణం బోల్తే మై ఏ కుచ్ నాహం జానా మీ కేయూరుకు నై పెహచాన్ సకతా హూ కుండలకు భీ నై పెహచాన్ సకతా హూ కభీ మే సీతా మాతా కా చెహరా దేఖా ఈ నై మై లేకిన్ ఓ పావు మే పహనే వాళ్ళే నూపురుకు మై పెహచాన్ సకతా హూ క్యూ నిత్యం పాదా మే మై హమేషా పాదవందనా కర్తా రహతా హూ సీతా దేవికి ఇస్లే వో తో మై పెహచాన్ సకతా హూ లక్ష్మణ సేస్ బట్ దట్ వాజ్ నాట్ యాక్సెప్టెడ్ బై బై భడోదా వర్షన్ బికాస్ దేస్ ఇస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఇట్ నాట్ ప్రాక్టికల్ బికాస్ లక్ష్మణ ఇతనే సాల్ ఉంటే చోదా సాల్ చెహరా ఈ నై దేఖా హే కైస హో సకతా హే సో దట్ వాజ్ ఆల్సో నాట్ యాక్సెప్టెడ్ అండ్ ఆల్సో తపస్వాధ్యాయ నిరతం తపస్వీ వాగ్విదాంబరం నారదం పరిపప్రక్ష వాల్మీకి ముని పొంగవ దిస్ ఇస్ ఎ ఫేమస్ వర్షన్ బట్ దట్ వాజ్ ఆల్సో క్రిటికల్లీ ఎగ్జామిండ్ బై దెమ్ బికాస్ if all these adjectives are going to narada only that means valmiki does not know anything so they did not accept and that version they kept like this the scholar told on the day that they made it the, the version original version is like this tapaswadhyaya niratah tapasvi vagvidam varah naradam paripraprachha valmiki munipungavah so all these adjectives are going to valmiki not to narada because valmiki himself was a great poet tapaswadhyay nirata he was a great poet not narada tapas who is tapaswadhyay nirata narada or valmiki they say that valmiki is tapaswadhyay nirata and he is tapasvi vagvidam varah you see very clearly that is why he wrote a poem he was a poet vagvidam varah so if you keep all adjectives to narada which we is which is very famous now in every ramayana in northern versions particularly uh that is not appropriate because uh, if valmiki does not know anything only narada knows everything why he asked about rama so then what is who is valmiki valmiki was a great scholar vagvidam varaha tapaswadhyaya nirataah tapasvi that is why he is asking about the rama so kon vasmin sampratam loke gunavan kashya viryavan dharmagnyascha krutagnyascha satyavadi drudhavrataah esa kon hai sansar mein wahan se shuru ho gaya so in this way i can only say that this book is so interesting I, i was getting an idea when just i read very few only two few pages but i think we can have complete a course or of study on ramayana a kind of department also we can open on the ram only on ramayana because we as ramayana is not just one poem ramayana is our culture ramayana is everything for, for indian ramayana katha lokeshu pracharishyati so in this way ramayana always it was there and it is there and it will be there always i am very happy to 
oh, today we are <laughs> discussing about the Ramayana and I wish that there should be many more occasions to discuss on Ramayana. This is uh, in the short period of time, we cannot discuss anything on Ramayana. Ramayana is such a great, like an ocean. So therefore, uh, but still today is a very good day for us because we are uh, uh, talking and listening uh, to the Ramayana.